Eastern Michigan did though. Woo! Ypsilanti. I was recruited as a one star, but I'ma go far. I'ma play my part. We on top every time you check the scoreboard. Wait no more. I'm here to bring the championship home. I don't care who died of me. I'm here to prove I'm all wrong. Yeah, I'm back on my back again. You give me the chance, I win. I do it for Michigan. I promise you won't die me again. The haters they died at me. I know they all be listening. It ain't no stopping me. I'm here to make us champions. Ladies and gentlemen, we'll be back to the episode of the MTNLA 14 Road to Glory. You guys know the drill. You guys keep doing it every single day. 3,000 likes. I'll post again tomorrow. I don't care. I love you all. Thank you so much for all the love and support on this series. If you guys missed last video, we pulled off the greatest upset, biggest win in school history. Boom, bam, bam. Shout out to the comments. We beat Michigan. Look at how Michigan State got schooled for that. Oh my gosh, top 25, they got killed. Love to see that, I hate Michigan State. I don't actually hate Michigan State, I just wanna preface that. It's just in the video game, we're Michigan, they're Michigan State. I love you guys, you guys know 3,000 likes. Oh my, I have a major comment question of the day today. I don't watch college football. Who do you guys who do watch college football think the best two quarterbacks? Like just give me a ranking of the quarterbacks coming out of the draft this year. I don't think the Titans are gonna draft one, I kinda of hope that we don't. Uh, but I'm just curious because, like I said, I had, didn't watch a lot of college football this year. Let me know in the comments. Guys, a lot of you have been asking for revamped. Why? Brett, why don't you play revamped? Man, I don't know how. I'm not smart. Also, there's something nostalgic about hearing the Xbox 360 breathe, man. Like, it, literally, I kid you not, I try and drown it out. But this Xbox 360 pretty much, like, one day it's going to catch fire. And that's why I have it in a fireproof box. Um, no, I'm just kidding. I, I should because this thing is chugging along. This is a relic. This thing is older than some people. This thing's probably 20 years, no, it's not 20 years, I don't even know, 15 years, 10 years old? I don't know, but guys, ba bam we just beat Michigan State. Um, I don't know what that's gonna do to our top 25 ranking. All I know is it's gonna help us out immensely. It's, Barrett is honored to top off a wild, I was honored? What was I honored in? Tell me what I was honored in. Was I the play? Tell me I was the player of the week. Tell me I was the player of the week. Come on. I sh Bro, how on earth? Okay, that guy did better than me. How did, who are you, Joel Mays? Shut up. Nobody asks Joel Mays. Oh my goodness. I, I thought I played the best game of anybody. We're not on Heisman Watch. Um, statistically, this season, we're having a really good start. A lot of the non-believers for Eastern Michigan are starting to like, hey, they're starting to come out and be like, hey, maybe, maybe I was wrong. I see you. I see all you guys. And a lot of you guys hate on my reads, man. I make reads. I, a lot, I get a lot of hate for my reads, but I just, on Heisman Heisman, with difficulty on the sliders, actually up, just pulled off one of the greatest upsets ever. So shut up. Don't, no, don't shut up. I appreciate you watching. I'm just kidding, but I'm angry, bro. Uh, we've had a great season so far, passing-wise. I'm killing it. I think if I can continue at the clip, look at Schwen, bro. This, no one's surprised. Through three games, 321 yards. I'd love to see him he'd get his touchdown numbers up, but Edward Howard's playing good. That's what like caused him from winning the Bolitnikov. It's just his lack of touchdown passes, but overall it is what it is. As of right now, our goal and our attainable goal is to try and win our conference. And I think it's doable. And I think that's kind of the first step to becoming one of the best schools. We're not in the top 25. I don't expect to get to the top 25. I think it would be very, very, very difficult this year to get that recognition as a top 25 school. We're just, we're not a very high overall um, and it's gonna take a long time. Someone did say that we are officially a two-star school, which is awesome. But I think a very attainable goal and one that I think we can do, um, I think we can win our conference. I think we can want, run, win the MAC. Uh, and if we do that, I truly believe that we will start to get better recruits going into my final two years. I think we'll start, like, if we can somehow pull this off, beat Central Michigan today. Central Michigan's a good team. They got they got a good quarterback, I'm pretty sure. Um, they're about they're better than us, but it's close. Definitely not going to be an easy game whatsoever. But if we can somehow win the MAC, um, beat Buffalo, this uh, this side of it is, is pretty weak. Miami University, all these are pretty weak. If we can win this, I think we have a good chance. And I think I hopefully can win the Heisman. Guys, you already know what it is. Keep killing the like button. Um, we're currently two and one. We're playing Central Michigan University. Um, we're at home in front of 
all of our screaming fans coming off of a massive W. I gotta be smart. Let's just go win again. Let's go beat CMU and let's go be great today. Ladies and gentlemen, how good CMU? You're, you ask? A little bit better than us. Actually, yeah, a little bit. Our, our, our offense is almost better though. Our offense is close. Okay. Let's dance, fellas. Come on, man. We had a good game against these guys last season. I got my can. Dude, where's my freaking tattoo sleeve? Let's go. Sleeve up. Guys, hey, this is the season. I'm starting to look freaking good, man. I'm starting to look good and feel good. I love this team. I love our green uniforms, too. Blitz coming. He scrambled. I politely escape the pocket. Lay to make Brian. And he gets a foot down. Do you guys know in um, the CFL? The like Canadian Football League is also one foot. It's just the NFL. So the CFL pretty much has all uh, college rules. I'm struggling with this hat. I don't actually wear this hat. Okay, I'm looking, ugh. This looks like to me kind of, yeah, this is a zone. That guy's gonna go to the running back, leaving a beautiful, beautiful pocket for me to hit Roosevelt McLeod for the automatic. First down, boom, let's go. PA power up. Roosevelt McLeod. Look for Geschwent. I've been working on this play a lot. Edward Howard, though. Shout out to the comments for letting me know. Go! Oh my gosh! What's the award? Is it the Mackey? Is it the, what's the award for the best tight end in college football? Cause he has been a menace this season. It's his senior year. Yo, NFL teams, I guarantee, are looking at Mackey. He has been so good for us. Great first drive. No runs, our coach doesn't believe in running the ball. Throwing a little bit upfield for Geschwent. What a catch and some extras. You know what? Let's run that right back. Let's let's actually run that one right back because probably want to see how this defense responds. I, I just don't see the, I love this play in the red zone. Especially with a little bit of a blitz. And that Oh my god. He's gonna be sacked for a loss. I'm gonna get hate for running backwards. That's on me. So if I stay up in the pocket, I'm sacked 10 seconds earlier. This looks like man is this man or zone? Maybe man across the board. Scrambling around. He's rolling I waited right. it out. Goodman, that's all right. He's Head down. Thank you, Goodman. Goodman. Jason got two for us. Oh, flood switch. Okay. Look for... Oh, Geschwent. Is Geschwent wide open here? Now he's scrambling. Heisman me. Heisman me. Picks up the fumble. He dives and he'll be marked down. You guys got to let me know how to dive, not like I'm... Absolutely crazy. I thought I made the right. I wanted to like the like more dive like into the. I kind of got it. Oh yeah, he just hit me. He hit me right on. He could not have hit that better. Right on the shoulder. Oh, and CMU scores. Dang guys, that's on me, bro. That I. That's all I can say. That's hundred percent on me. I gotta make a better read. I gotta make a better read through and through here. Yep, there we go. Par. <laughs> Did you guys think that he had, am I, oh, Parham. Dang, he 100% had more Second room to the left. On the yard line. This looks like man on Geschwent over there on the side. Barrett off the fake. The cavalry's coming. Oh, yeah, and he just gets third rid of down. Yeah, they're playing defense right now. Oh, look, Phillips here pressure. to Goodman. I, I'm just kind of watching that outside corner. If he follows, it's probably man. Like, he follows the whole way. Meaning that I can hit Goodman right on the break. Let's go. That's how you read a defense. Jason Goodman. That's that's why that's a good play. That is why that's a play. Man, oh man. End of the first quarter. This is not going precisely how I wanted it to. But we got to score on this drive. No mistakes, bro. It's first down. Man, oh, fumbles will kill seasons. I'm telling you, fumbles will kill seasons. This has got to be a blitz. There's no safety. They got to be screaming. No, just throw that to Roosevelt McLeod right in the middle. Right. Even the announcer and the announcer's hyping me up. This is this looks like man across the board. Yeah, let's just give this to Parham. Good go! His biggest run is up. Is that how sad is that? I genuinely think that's Parham's like biggest run for me ever. And it was like eight yards, and he got depleted. Ball on the 43. Look for Roosevelt one on one. I don't think that's. Oh, see, they just they just switched. It's now a cover two. I bet. Now I think it's. I think I got someone open over the middle if I if I have time. Let's. I need to lob that. Oh, I'll own that. That was stupid. 
I'll be the first to admit that was stupid. Okay, this is a good play. Good motion. Um, if they're blitzing heavy, throw it to Roosevelt. Oh, what a breakup by number 10. I don't take that read back. Oh, gosh. Okay. Tenya, I, I, gotta, I need protection. Goodman or Geschwent? Goodman or Geschwent? One of the two. I think it's going to be Goodman. Good man! Good man! Go! Oh, don't get caught, Jason! Good dot! Over the middle. Laser. Don't get caught, though. I'm sick of that. Don't get caught. I'm sick of that. Edward Howard here. Quick. Edward, How Edward Howard on the corner. Lane! Come on! Like I said, that our, we, we've had two great drives. Like I said, that one just was capped off a lot better. That was actually a perfect throw to the corner. Edward Howard got a foot down. Defense need a stop, and our defense gives us a stop before half. Let's go. Okay. Geschwent. They're not pressing. They're really afraid of Geschwent. Oh, this is a blitz. Look at that. Look at that. that oh, my God. That is freaking pocket present. Don't at me. Don't at me. That is, uh, I sense the blitz. I move all the way to the left. And we throw a laser. Okay, here we got this same play that's been killing them. That play has been, like, I'll throw to Ed. That's his first off of the year, I think. Correct me if I'm wrong. That's, I think, who do you guys think, other than me, has had the best season two so far? Like, we're, we're three games in. Who's playing the best? You gotta throw it a little bit high. So that McLeod gets the first. And that's like exactly how you throw that ball. Five thousand times in this offense. So I, I know that play. That's underrated. I'm gonna rant. Listen, if you're listening, comment hashtag Under Armour. But it's underrated in these series. Like I've like look at this. That guy just cycled down. I just he's that. That's a blitzer. This is a hundred percent man on man. I bet. I might get man on man with Goodman. He's under pressure. Um, I'm dipping. Yo. He's at the 40. He's out of bounds. I just thought I would under throw it. Yard line. I couldn't do it. Did you guys see B? When, I gotta look back. When did he get open? Because I know the comments are going to tell me. When did B get open? Soon as I started running. But like, I can't make that throw. That's 60 in air. This guy's sprinting. I think that's a pick. I think I made the right call. And plus, why do I have my just this? I got the first down. Of course I made the right call. Oh, that would have been a sick touchdown though. That's interesting that that DB just broke like he did. Look for the 10 out to get Schwent. Two guys, two safeties up top. This to me looks like, oh, I got a dip. Oh my gosh, shut up! Aaron freaking Rodgers! Oh my goodness! Heisman me! Year two! Yo, I did not think I was gonna... Did you guys think that was gonna be a... I saw him open? Oh my gosh. And it's on the money too. Five plays, 79 yards, and our defense gets another stop. Yo, let's... We are the best team in Michigan. Don't at me. This is the best team in Michigan. Schwent gets off the press. Oh, that's. Oh my gosh. That's make the sack. Time out. Throws to the middle. Leaps picked off. And they make the stop at the 41 what yard line. Cover two. I thought I could throw it. See, when I, like in Madden, for example, you see this look. If I lob it, it's going to go here. Because I know this looks bad. If I lob it, it's gonna go there. I probably had him. Oh my gosh, that's just a horrible read before half, and they and they tie it up. Oh. Okay, come on, Parham. Need a good second half out of you, Parham. I don't know if that's the. They'll bring him down at the 33. I just we got no help over here, man. Oh, and I'm sorry to the defense. Defense is getting cheated by me because. We can't afford to lose this. Watch that nickel on that side. Is he blitzing? Throw it a little upfield. Ben Phillips. Oh my gosh. Holy Ben. You are the GOAT for what you just did. What a hit. Just went but needs to get out. No way. 
No way, that's a freaking linebacker. Oh, leverage wise, I just don't buy that. Leverage wise, I just don't buy that. That's a dot to Roosevelt McLeod. When in doubt, get it to your best. Robert Paul would never. Oh my goodness. That's one of the best plays I've seen. That is legitimately one of the best plays I have seen. Okay, need seven. Watch those safeties. Cover, they rolled into a cover two. I know I got the middle of the field if I can. It was wide open. Oh, I know you guys saw it too. It was cover two all the way. I knew I had the middle of the field. Bro. Okay, here I'm looking McBride or, oh, it's a blitz. Yeah, McBride. It's two drops for him today, just as I gassed him up. Oh, and then I got four verticals. We cannot lose this game, guys. We gotta just fight. This is an adversity one, guys. This is 100% adversity. Ladies, Ben Phillips. Come on, let's go, Ben. We're pushing the ball downfield more. Beauty, absolute beauty. Defense gets a stop, okay. Oh, I gotta make up for that stupid pick before half. I'm so mad at myself for that. That safety just went down, this is a zero look. Just get rid of it. I was just trying to, when I see a blitzer, and I'm old, this isn't necessarily what they, they do teach this in like college football in the NFL, but like when you see a blitzer, it's not a, like a bad idea to just roll the opposite way. You roll, and like oftentimes your line will know that and like call it out this is cover two stepping up he's under some heat lays roosevelt nice All catch that could be pushed out of bounds good play though you hear my xbox my xbox is freaking out at me right now that's six for 77 for roosevelt he's on the run and they got it cloud goodman just went blitz over the middle Yo, good, good pickup, Brett. Good eyes, good eyes. He looks like the guy, my guy in the middle almost got down. I, I did not expect to be looking for that guy. I can't run the speed off the coach. I'm sorry, I'm not. Game on the line, huge game against a Michigan rival. Yeah, no. On play action. Lave and McBride catches that one. Rory McBride, beautiful. Chooses Dan. This play's been working all day. If they're in cover two looks, if those safeties, like, this is not, this is a cover three or man. This is, they roll over. Oh my gosh. I had RB, that guy on the left kind of drop. Oh, I looked away from it when I saw what it, I thought it was. Too high. This has got to be zone, right? It's a man. Throw it on the break to Gashwet. Let's go. Heads up, though. I don't know. I just don't trust our run game. And I know that sounds ridiculous. I don't trust it. Okay, if this is cover zero, I'm looking Roosevelt and McLeod. Oh, my gosh. Goodman. I just threw the best back shoulder throw of my life. Oh, my gosh. I just threw the best back shoulder throw of my life. They're screaming at you. Geschwent, let's go. When in doubt, Geschwent. Absolute laser in man man. That play before, that was one of my favorite throws actually of the entire series because Here's play number 10 on the drive. he was kind of super inside, so I just gave him a chance the other. This play, if Phillips isn't open, I like to roll and look pylon for Roosevelt. Roll. He's gonna try and scramble. Under heavy pressure. Yep, no fumbles. Second and one. Throw that low. Just went! Nice catch! Take the check down. Check down's equal. Touchdown, let's go. All day I was looking Damian Parham right there. I saw the people were moving. I'm like, I'm throwing a Damian. Beautiful, simple catch. McLeod or Gashwen were not open. And ladies and gentlemen, we got a two score lead and our defense steps up, 242 left. Hey, victory formation. You guys always tell me, let the computer run the ball. Um, so I'm letting this computer run the ball and we get six. I run the power options though. I got no problem doing this. Okay, let's practice this. Not that we're in a practice position, but. Oh my gosh. 
That's fun. Oh, that's tough. Good run. That is tough. Skip it. We're, we're killing clock. Look at, look, as soon as I don't watch, Parham goes crazy. And it's, I need that because I need him to get better as a player. So it's like, I don't mind simming those. Oh, wow. Look at Edward Howard. Easy money, Lob it to the corner. Get to that quick and it's going the other way. This game really bugs me with those plays. Wow, what were they thinking? Throwing with the lead this way. Yeah, I look crazy, but like this game's stupid sometimes. I lobbed this ball right here to him. I'm just going all off of like I threw a lob pass right here. I threw a lob pass. It should go right here because there's nobody there. It should be a perfect throw. The lob passes in this game are broken. Look at where this lob goes. So frustrating. Okay, and now we're now we're in a bad spot because of that, which is stupid. The whistle hasn't sounded yet. Oh gosh. Okay, get a first down. That frustrates me. It really does. Parhan, you got good blockers in front of you. And this for us, Parhan. Central Michigan. We'll take the second time. Did we get the first? We did. That's GG's. GG's guys. Oh, let's go, fellas. Let's celebrate it. Boom! Let's go. Yeah, so that's gonna do Good freaking it. win. We got to celebrate. I know it, I'm mad about that last pick, but we threw some dots today. We took strides as a team. I think what I saw in this game versus all last season, we're starting to push the ball downfield. We no longer need to score off of slants. Like, and the coach, in turn, is giving me a lot more of those big-time, like, get roll out throws and I'm looking Heisman man I'm looking good out here let's freaking go we shut up Central Michigan at home um stat wise I was fine um if it wasn't for that last pick I would have had a really good game four touchdowns two picks 358 my best receiver today was everybody that's I think uh, that's the kind of stat line that you want to see McLeod Goodman Geschwent everyone caught the ball today and I think that's that's the stuff that makes champions is when you know everybody on your team can be successful. 41 um, for Damian Parham on the ground. That's one of his best games, as shocking as that is. And that's no offense to Damian Parham. I'm sure you're a very nice virtual guy, but you got to take that. Okay. Oh, I don't know who we got next week. Let's go see. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, oh, that pushes us to 3-1 and one, um, on the season. Like I said, we're not going to win any awards for that game. There's no... My stat standings won't be anything great, but we're at the top right now, man. We are three and one puts us right next to Northern Illinois. Toledo's not having a great year, and we are about to play um, the best team in the MAC East, the three and two Buffalo Bulls, um, for a chance to like. If we win this game, man, we go to four and one. That's a scary record. I don't, I don't know. We're not top. We're not top twenty-five. Obviously, it's gonna take. And a lot of you guys said you want to be updated on the top 25. Texas a and is currently the best school in the nation. Oregon, Texas, Ole Miss, LSU, Notre Dame, um, Nebraska, Virginia Tech, Stanford. These are the best teams. Um, the ones getting respect. It's going to take a lot. For us to actually get any respect, we probably need a couple undefeated seasons. Like, it's, it's not going to happen anytime soon. As far as Heisman goes and that award, our biggest competition is this guy, is the senior Andrew Moore from Alabama. Um, he has 16 touchdowns already on the season to four interceptions and 1,600 yards through however many games they've played. I don't think that's even that many games. The thing that separates a lot of these dudes is he also has 405 yards rushing on the season. So this dude all-purpose is sitting – like winning the highs in this game is so hard. Like, he's got 1,600, 2,100 all-purpose yards. Dude's disgusting. Look at his last game. Last game wasn't as good, but like he still had four total touchdowns. Then you got the Texas A&M kid. This guy, this Corey Harris is just, he won the 2013 Maxwell. This guy is just, he's a freaking junior. This guy's the best. When we get to the NFL, this guy will be there. He'll be sitting right, if, if he doesn't go this year, I don't know what to tell you. This guy is disgustingly good. Last season, he was 39-9 and nine in his sophomore year for 3,700 yards, and he ran for 1,000. 1,000! He passed for 3,700, 
ran for a thousand as a sophomore. This guy is ridiculous. I already know when I do the NFL series, Corey Harris will 100% be a player in it. He is unbelievable. And he's this, like, honestly, all these guys. Tony Carter, if we look at him, um, he won the Heisman last year. And he's a senior this year. He was a junior last year. But last year, he had 3,500 yards and 949. I think it could have went either way. They both had similar stats last season. But Tony Carter, I think they, I think Ohio State ended up winning the national championship. But these are this is our competition. Dylan Parham? Is that the good one? Why? Is there two Dylan Parhams that are... What's... My guy's Donald, isn't he? No, my guy's Damien. They're brothers, I bet. That's so tough. Okay. Damien Parham is my best. Um, Andrew Gilmore. This kid, I didn't talk about him much. And I want to take a second to actually talk about him because I do think I disrespected him a little bit by not mentioning him. Our backup running back, and I wish I could get him the ball way more, is a redshirt sophomore. So we have, th and he's a 75 overall. We have three more years of Andrew Gilmore and his stats are like, Already super tough. I think this kid, you will hear his name. The final two, he's going to be with me my entire career. He's a sophomore as well. Like we're going to play every year together. And I think he is going to be disgusting. So shout out to him. Um, we have nothing really to buy at this point. You can buy like weird stuff for like single game boost, like elusiveness, stamina, yada, 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 blah, 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 blah. You don't care about any of this. But um, overall, we got to beat Buffalo. And that's what it comes down to. Buffalo, if I remember from last, I'm not going to mess this up. I, I promise you guys, I, I felt so stupid when that video went up because I did not realize. Like, I promise you, I got so, I literally was just like making a joke about the other one. So dumb. I, some people thought I did it on purpose. I wish. Like watching it back, I was like, I am the biggest meathead in the world. And I'm not going to mess up this one. Buffalo. Unless there's two Buffaloes. Okay, Joe Perry, uh, Higgins, they got an all right offense, but not great. It's more the defense that I want to see. Yeah, their pass rush isn't good. I think we're a better football team than them. They're all right at DB. They got one guy who's going to the NFL and Tyler Evans, um, or a practice squad player at least. But this is a big game against Buffalo, guys. We got a chance to go to 4-1 and one and continue to show the world what we're about. And we're at Buffalo. Oh, no, we're at home. Let's go. Back at home, EMU, let's go. Okay, let's go, give us the football, man. Ooh, this one, this is a cross, kind of. Look at our fans. Oh my gosh, is there not? Tell me, at me. Tell me there's not more. That's so cool to see. Okay, so because we're performing better, and we have a winning record, I told you guys, this is the most important to me. First time I've seen this. We have a sold out, Stadium here at Eastern Michigan. Why are, there, are those Buffalo fans? Do they just travel well? Look at all the Buffalo fans. So cool to see here, man. I love this campus. I, I love this stuff. Hey, that's all I cared about, man. I'm putting EMU on the map. I want someone. I want a top high school recruit quarterback from Canada to go with EMU because he saw this series. And go do this. He's scrambling. He's got to throw it in a hurry. I'm different. And he's shot out of bounds at the 36 yard line. Said, I, I got to start running more. I, I'm not, I'm more of a pocket guy. I really am. But I'm not slow. Like, I'm like an 83 speed, but I'm also not blazing fast. Okay, safety over top. Roosevelt McLeod has room. You got to throw it behind him. Though. That's such a dot. That's such a dot! I wasn't doing that as a freshman. Good throw. Good throw. Good throw. Good throw. Safety over there. Geschwent's open. Only he can get that. Yes, sir, Geschwent. Clockwork, fellas. 21 on the side. Come on. This is a great red zone play, actually. This is like old school red zone offense. Play fake and Geschwent. If it's man, you're looking Geschwent. Play action. He scrambled. See you, kid. I see you. Come on, Neil, fight, Neil. Ooh, third and goal, okay. Buffalo standing up in the red zone. Look for Phillips quick, maybe. Check for the blitz. Lays. 
Whoa! Okay, go for this. I'm not letting them kick a field goal here. Go for this. Oh, gosh. Throw it to McBride. Let's go, McBride! Boom! Rory McBride. Clutch all year. You know, red zone threat. If this was Madden, he's got red zone threat. Seven. Buffalo gets three. That's cool with me. Buffalo gets three. That's, that's all right with me. Come on. Schwed's being pressed on that side. Look at those safeties. They kind of split up. Oh, that the guy in the middle is trying to drop, though. Yep. And he's tackled around the 33 yard line. Did you see that middle guy? That was kind of like a. I don't know what the exact term in the States, but yeah, he was just like the middle linebacker dropped back into a deep zone to kind of cover the middle, or else I think I would have had exactly what I was talking about there. Scrambling around. Get rid of it. Third down, that's fine. Look for Goodman, Geschwent. They're playing that same freaking defense I just talked about. It's like a, it's a hybrid. It's like a three, I think it's called a three double buzz. Um, I'll show you what I mean in case you, you probably don't care, but this is essentially what they're doing. They're linebacker. See their middle linebacker? It's like, yeah, it's a three double buzz. He's dropping back and playing. These guys are both in vert hooks. Like, just like their responsibility is like, Short stuff, but their middle linebacker is playing their middle safety. So it looks like a two off the snap, but that guy drops back, which means it is a cover three. So you actually don't have the middle. It's if you, if they've watched our game tape, it's actually a really, really, really like if you if you were to try and defend us, I would say you watched the last game against Central Michigan. We attacked the middle a lot. It's a really, really, really good strategy. Good first quarter though. Oh, sacks from what did I do wrong there? Was that just pressure? Was that just O line Eastern getting Michigan burnt, or is, is that on four. me? Verticals I love versus zone, but man, I hate it. We're, we're getting screamed at. Punt the football. Falls incomplete. That's just great defense. Stop him! Stop him! They. Oh, Buffalo goes down. Man, those last two plays, I feel like I've had bad protection. I think I got to get out of the pocket here. I really do. Just based on those last two plays, I'm like, I got to open the field up for myself because in the pocket, I'm getting absolutely yelled at. So I need to use my legs. I need to get out of the pocket. And I got to make them respect that aspect of the game. Just based on what I'm seeing right now, that that's like my read on this entire situation is like, throw it behind him. Oh my gosh, he almost picked that. Oh gosh. Should have Roosevelt. Make sure that DB. That's a dot. I, go, go Roosevelt. Oh my gosh. I love that guy. Oh, he sure does, and he doesn't. What a guy. Oh my, a burner. He did not show that last. That's probably one of the best receiver plays I've seen after the catch. Oh, look at them. Look at them blitzing the middle again. Yep. Don't fumble though. Don't fumble. First of all, my rushing yards have gone up this game. This has been a good rushing one for us. Blitz coming. That's fine. Second down. Phillips are good in here. Second down. Or if the linebackers really vacate. Pressure coming. Lays Roosevelt as it should be. As that drive should end with a beam to Roosevelt McLeod. What a guy. Man, that was the best play he had on that drive that I've seen in a very long. 33 seconds. Hey, hey, everybody, come here, come here, come here. Huddle up. Huddle up, we got 33 seconds, this is big. They, they're gonna regret giving us this this time. Yeah, they blitz us, Ben Phillips all day. Kind of, that's what a simple of a read as you can have. Easy blitz. This play of, I get McLeod again. That, this out route that McLeod is the one that he took for 66. He got it. Makes the catch and he and gets out of foot. Oh my gosh, he's playing at a high level right now. End zone touchdown. I didn't know if I'd get over the linebackers, but I did. Didn't know if I could, I did though. Didn't know if I could, I did though. Oh my gosh. Yo, what did we do, defense? Oh my gosh, what did we do, defense? Beam. And he's level at the Time out. Eastern Michigan's out of 
Oh, take three. Take three. Let's go. I'm fine with it. They get, okay. They get three. Yo, our defense gave us a free three there. That was beautiful football. Okay, this play, one of the easiest reads in the game. Uh, Geshwem moves. You just kind of read his guy. Good man. Good man. Throw him upfield. That was risky. That Buffalo DB was out to lunch. I, I threw him upfield like that to try and get extra yards, and I realistically shouldn't. Okay, this post play, they're not, if they're not in that robber defense, this post play could work. Their line just did some weird stuff. Here comes the pressure. And he's taken down. For Roosevelt on the left. He's just having one of those games, dude. He's having one of those games where this is just pitching catch. These guys are not guarding me right now. This is just, pit I don't miss Reed. Roosevelt McLeod, this is, I believe, his senior year. Um, and he's showing out, man. He's showing out. They just, see, they just rolled over into potentially, uh, I think this is cover three. He rolls out to the right. Looking for the corner. He's taken down around the 15 yard line. I see me. Oh my God. I hit RB there and I got, I did like a little cool juke. Okay. This player would do a good job of putting us in a good situation. Goodman's always a good read on here. Geschwent thrown to the almost the pylon. That's Just a great yep. tackle at the four yard line. Eleven. Now he's scrambling. Decides to take it himself, and he's got it. Touch Boom! Let's go. Come on, come on. Defense gonna stop. Our defense does precisely that. Let's go. No, hey, we keep passing. Coach, coach, you let us keep passing, please. We're having fun out here. We're the one now in the map. We're the best team in this conference. And I wanna, I wanna prove it to the whole nation. Oh, and then I win a national championship my junior year, and then I'll see you in the NFL. I will see you in the NFL. There's 40 NFL scouts watching this game right now. It's first down. Oh man, I got you. I got you. I'm gonna do something stupid with how much I'm talking right now. Here, I gotta get out. The kid is just getting open today. When in doubt, I'm looking for Roosevelt, man. Oh my goodness, Roosevelt McLeod. You are having one of those games. He's gonna try and scramble. Different, different. And to who even is that? Jamil Clark for t everybody gets 25 today. No, we're passing. Give me a pass. Give me a pass. We've got a first and ten. Ball on the 21. We want a victory. We want a victory. Oh wow, that's my first bad throw of the day. Man on man. He's Easiest in read in the book. Okay, why are we missing that? That's as simple as a read as I have. Man on man on the outside. Here I got Geschwent. Oh my gosh, what are they doing? Geschwent. Push him! Push him, John! Push him! Tell him what's up, John! No, I want. Oh yeah, no. Let, let him run. Hey, Parham get This is where. This is where Parham gets his plays. Because. I don't give Park. Parham doesn't get a lot of love from the coach. Not necessarily me. We never run the ball on this team. We are an air raid attack. So in these situations, it's actually cool to see Parham. But when we do run, we're third and 14. This has a low, this is cover two. Unless that guy in the middle drops back, it's cover two, meaning I can just throw a quick laser middle of the field to John Geschwen, and he will get a first down. Beauty, 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 beauty. Lays Edward Howard. Oh my gosh. Talk about a broken play. Big game for Edward Howard. Lays again, Edward. Did we score on that? Oh, fumble. Oh, goodness, Parham. Parham fumbled on his last run. That's rough. And it, Parham. There's seven. Like I said, I'm just sitting here rooting for him. I'm just sitting, that's five for him, good for you. GG's guys. Look, this is where Parham gets his yards. We just say, you know what? You can run when we're up by 30. 
And that's precisely what happens. Another five. And he's running down like... GG's, guys. Boom! Let's go! Shut him up! Shut him up! Play the game. That was a... That, that was a dot. That was an absolute dot. We don't just throw it, though. So the thing is, some people play this game, they just try and throw it. You can't play this game that way. You gotta wait for your opportunities. And when they come, boom, I'm player of the game. 24 of 33, I ran well. I threw the ball even better. Um, and we did a great job there. A super, super, super great job of just leading our team to victory. That was simple, man. Sometimes this game doesn't have to be complex. This game is simple. Buffalo's not a bad team. That was a 2 and one football team uh, who had dominated similar competition to us. And what we're trying to do now, we're trying to build a culture of winning. That's what I'm about. Culture of winning. I, I want to show everybody that Eastern Michigan is not a layup. We, we're the one seed. Like, we're, we're the team to beat in this conference. Yeah, we haven't been in the past, but that was before I got here. And I'm different. 16 touchdowns, 5 interceptions, 2,000 yards, averaging 378. And then on the ground, I got 50. Yeah, I'm bad running. That's where I suck because I take so many freaking sacks. That's where I'm trash. That is where I'm trash because, and that's probably what honestly hurts me because I take, why does this sack? Is it soon as I run and I get sacked, it counts as a negative run, I think is how it works, but is what it is. Um, that, this guy went crazy against Bama. Corey Harris once again went crazy, but our numbers are, are close to that. And I think we definitely are the best QB in our, in our given conference, which is really, really, really cool. Um, if we look at season stats, just in the Mac West, I think we're playing. And honestly, I think our school throws more than any other school in the freaking world. Like, I'm the best QB in the Mac West. Like that, this guy is playing really good, Brandon Gant. Um, he's playing really, really good, but I'm also playing really good as well. Alex Colbert, he's a good player. Branson. And like, these guys are a lot of like, I'm a sophomore. We got a senior, a junior, a senior, and a sophomore red shirt. Like I'm a true sophomore, true freaking sophomore. And we're dominating guys. Hey, kill a like button. I want another one tomorrow, guys. This is our season. We win a couple more games. The world's going to be on notice. We got West Michigan and then UMass. That's going to be a good game against UMass. That's a tough school. Um, same with Miami University. All those are going to be tough games. Then we finished with Then We got Ball State and NIU, which circle those in the calendar that'll probably be friday if you guys kill a like button old dominion that's gonna be a tough one hey thank you to everyone who supports the series see you guys tomorrow